Hello crafty friends. I'm back today with another card for the Dice R Us design team. I'm using um, the Elizabeth Craft Lazy Poppies that I used on a previous uh, design team project and the layered butterflies that I used on the last. I'm combining both on a, on a new card, on a slim card. I love slim cards. I've always liked them and I am so happy that they are uh, getting really popular lately. Um, so let's let's work. As usual, I've die cut everything. Um, so let's move these over here. So what I've done is I have my card base and for my card base I just use regular 110 pound generic cardstock. Usually it's um, either I think it's usually Michael's because um, I find that the 110 part or 110 pound cardstock from Michael's is heavier it just feels heavier to me than the heavy weight cardstock from um, Hobby Lobby even though their packaging says 110 pound when I compare them side by side the Michael's uh, feels heavier to me so I tend to uh, wait for a sale a 50% sale and I buy those um, so uh, that's my car base uh, for my um, card bottom card panel I tend to always gravitate towards um, Strathmore mixed media 400 uh, weight paper usually for my water coloring um, and I tend to just use that paper more than anything um, I'm not water coloring today but it was already die cut and I just went for it and then for my top layer I'm using a piece of um, pattern paper variegated pattern paper so and if you want to know the name of this pet where it came from it came from uh, the paper studio it's a foil uh, piece um, in the paper studio I think the paper studio is by Hobby Lobby let me see does it say no but it's just yeah Hobby Lobby it says Hobby Lobby and it's called the paint shop design 20 designs three of each So let's go ahead and this is a really easy design. I had these dies on my desk from the last time I had uh, used them and I just wanted to um, use them again. They're really, I've really enjoyed using them for the last couple of uh, weeks that I've been playing with them. I wanted to get one more design project with them and then um, move on to something else. So. Um, I use this pattern paper because I've, it, it looked like grass and to sky. So we're going to do that and then we're going to put more adhesive and put it onto our card. And now, and then I, um, before I die cut all the elements, I uh, put double sided uh, score tape on them so that I, they're ready to be adhered. My flower, I just used the biggest of the flowers, of the poppies. And I die cut it with, um, from white glitter cardstock. And I just want a really nice clean look. My butterflies, once again, like in my last project, I gravitated towards the um, the smaller of the butterflies. And this time I die cut the them from vellum. And my vellum has a slight pattern to to it. 
if you want to see. And this is really, really old vellum from a kit that I got years and years ago. Uh, does it even have a name? Uh, Metallic Crinkle 12 by 12 um, by Color Block. <laughs> oh my God, that's old. That's probably, that could probably be like almost 20 years old, maybe 15 years old. So. And then the next one. And you see how really, and this vellum is um, a thicker vellum. It has a, a little bit of weight to it. So. Okay, so, hmm. Now that I see them, the I'm not sure if I like the the vellum on them. They need some. They need a little bit more pop. I think. I'm gonna cut. I have to find my big scissors so I can cut. Losing my um, I'm going to cut the little bodies of the butterfly. And maybe make them cut them out of I'm gonna cut them out of glitter paper glitter white paper maybe I'm not sure let's see where's my glitter paper or um, here's a little bit of leftover glitter paper that I could use. Let's see if this works. Uh, I like that much better. Yes, I like that a lot. Uh, let's get the adhesive out of there. What do you think? I like that a lot. Now, what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to take some I'm going to make some uh, little Like a trail, a little butterfly trail.
What do you think? Oh, I like that. That's cute. Okay, so I like that. Oh, I don't like... Let me clean that one up. Let me do that one. That's better. And there's my cart. A quick card with two really versatile, really cute die sets that will inspire you to create a ton of cute cards. I mean, these can be turned into awesome projects. I hope you enjoyed this quick video and that you um, tune in for the next time. So until next time, have a good time. Bye.